your sign of cancer this is kim gonna get your reading done today for april 5th through the 11th your weekly 2021 thank you all for joining me liking sharing subscribing if you want a private reading those are done for for donations look in the description box below and let's get started so calling in cancer's angel spirit guides higher self higher power Let's get messages that are for Cancer's highest good only for April 5th through 11th. This is two overall energies. First from the Archetype deck for Cancer. The Vision, nice, really nice. And then the Pilgrim, wow. This is about journey and exploration to or through a vision that you have, maybe from your soul to maybe like a soul vision. Let's get one tarot card to go in the middle from the Dreams of Gaia deck. So for one tarot card, so your vision is something that you know that once you start, it's going to be very achievable and beneficial to all people. You'll be at your peak performance when this vision comes to life for you. You may feel sometimes we get alone when we're at the top because we're doing so well. We don't have anybody else that can, you know, it's like you're mentoring other people or you're giving other people information through this vision. So when you need help or guidance, there not, might not be as many people to help you just because you're the one here with the vision. So they're going to go to you for the answers. The pilgrim or the pilgrimage almost is like the traveler, the person who's going through this journey. You exploring, traveling, what you're doing at this moment or this, this time in your life, period in your life. Yeah, let's get one tarot card please for the middle, for the main energy of this reading. Poor Cancer, what do we have? All right, so Earth, we have the Queen of Pentacles energy. And you know, Queen of Pentacles is all about being very grounded in family life or and or just the home life experience. Having a certain way of living that you like and keeping that status quo up plenty of material things, always flowering, always coming up with new ideas of progress and growing. Could be Taurus, uh, Virgo, or Capricorn too. So let's look at the Zen Tarot. We're gonna do a past, present, future spread for you. Cancer, let's see what your past, present, and future is. Okay, past energy for Cancer. Right. There might have been a, um, a person in your life, either Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, who may have put you down for having strong emotions, kind of viewing people as weak for having emotions or clueless. This person's kind of harsh. Queen of Swords type energy in the reverse. So this person could have even made jokes and thinking and further alienated themselves though by saying or thinking that people are ignorant the ones that use so much emotion compared to them the they feel like they use the logical brain part and that that's so much superior this could cause or did cause depression or anxiety and then there was this new start with a partnership that I don't think went very well. Could be Gemini and Aries. So a new start that kind of didn't didn't go well or didn't take off like you thought. It wasn't as harmonious, I guess, as you thought it was going to be. So the present, present tense cards for Cancer. Oh. 
Oh, nice. So we have abundance here. Ten of Wands, giving it your all, but listen, it's going to pay off. So give it your all. Reach your limits with this Ten of Wands, and it might feel even like complete exhaustion, but it is the beginning of something really great, a time of abundance, period of prosperity with the King of Pentacle energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, maybe starting a business, entrepreneurship. It's whatever it is that you do with this energy, it brings in a lot of abundance because you had ta -da -da, a breakthrough from a breakdown. Breakthrough from a breakdown. Cancer, let's look at the future energies. Still, still need to maybe find your inner voice. In the future, you might be losing patience with something. So we do have a wish. We have a wish granted, right? And we have rebirth from having to go through a lot of, I think, traumatic events. A new person, more courageous, more bold, is arising from that. Wish granted, Nine of Cups, emotional, material realm, whatever. Needing to still work on finding your truth. So you'd be working on finding your truth. Something you might be losing patience with, though. It's not an easy rebirth. Let's do um, the tarot and see what it has to say about this. Needing to find your inner voice in this patience card. Manifesting. Maybe you're trying to manifest a really good harmonious partnership and you're giving you're having trouble doing so, either in a career or a relationship. This is general or any kind of commitment. There might be things that were hidden, unknown, but came out. It was like having a breakthrough about a commitment. And like I said, this, this partnership, like having to deal with either giving new life to this partnership or moving on and I feel like I feel like you're working on something still waiting still waiting for a message that contains a new beginning maybe related to like a child or something like that could be a Taurus Pisces or a child water sign and then we have the lovers and it's in reverse there's some, there's some partnership issues here might be talking about a Gemini, but they're definitely, or there's issues with making a big decision, but I don't see the two swords. I think it's more about this partnership. Let's get you some guardian angel cards or one. Okay. Angel encouragement means you're going through a really hard time right now. And this is coming to you from your angels to give you encouragement in the time being, give you encouragement to keep on going because you know, you're doing good. Just keep on going is the energy that I'm picking up on. Is you know, like this exhaustion. Keep on going even after you feel like you can't give any more. You can. Not easy, you know, easier said than done, I'm sure. Cancer, we have wedge. You or someone is trying to come come between you and something you want, or you and a friend. That might be this this uh, partner energy in reverse. Flute, disappointment in a friend or lover. Kite, a vacation. Travel with the pilgrim. Casket, somebody that's going out of your life for the end of a situation. Lobster, a financial pinch. But floor leaf clover, great and good fortune. Finger warning you of a problem either now or in the future. But cobweb protected from negative forces beyond your control. All right, Cancer, that's what I got for your week. Thank you so much for joining me. Sending you love and light. Bye-bye.